and putting your shoes on. Uh oh, we gotta toss this iron, babe. It's the second week of Ramadan and I decided, well Amir and I decided that it's not the best thing for me to be fasting right now. I have noticed that um, I have been feeling a little like faint and like dehydrated and stuff. So we decided that, you know what, maybe it's a little bit too early for me to be trying to fast. Right now we're about to head to the park and then that's about it. Get your little baby boy over here. Get over here. <laughs> Where's my Sully? Hi! Hi! You ready to go for a little midday walk? We gotta zip up your jacket though. Leave those on. He doesn't want to hold your hand, does he? Please don't break your neck, babe. Please. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I should try. <laughs> I haven't done a backflip in. Well, I probably did it sometime this year. No, you didn't. At wrestling practice. Oh. That'll be you in a couple years, Sully. Do it, son. Ready to go? Look at him with his little feet crossed like that. Like a grown man. I can't wait for my wife to cook, you know. We decided to take the day off. We decided this together that it wasn't the best thing for me and Suli. Yeah, but I'm saying this for the vlog. <laughs> Gosh, Amir, we gotta lay his thing back. Do it gently, though. <laughs> I don't know how far we walked, but we left the house around like 5.30, maybe? No, we got to the park at 5.30. So we left the house around like 5.00. 525 maybe and we're home at like seven and like my body feels it like I'm so tired. Quran tells us in the beginning there was only Allah. There was nothing else but then he created everything. Allah made the heavens, Allah made the earth, Allah made every animal, the beautiful little bird and the strong magnificent lion. He wants us to care for our parents and family our friends, our neighbors, the orphan, and the needy. The end. <laughs> I got Suli looking like a 90s baby today. Hey, Suli. Hi, baby. Hey. So, it's laundry day, and um, we try to do laundry like every two weeks. And since we, we live in an apartment, um, you could like hear the excitement in my voice. It's not actually doing laundry, that's the annoying part. It's folding them. I still have clothes that I need to fold from two weeks ago. I've been like living out of my basket. It's about that time of the year when the fruit starts growing on the trees. We have a cherry plum tree in our backyard, so I'm pretty excited. And no one ever eats these fruit. I don't think they realize that it's a fruit tree. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, that's your mommy baby. Oh, that's your mommy baby. Oh. 
Yeah. Oh, that's your mommy, baby. I mean, the sound is just so pleasant. Maybe you could order some off Amazon or something. Are you done? Okay, let's go. Let's get you out and you'll take a nap, okay? Look at those ducks just chilling on somebody's front lawn. Like, what even? Why are you here, ducks? You don't go fast. Stop trying to run. Hey. Hey, Sully. You enjoying your walk? Um, here's a happy smile. Here's a happy smile. It's almost time to break fast. Before a mirror. Okay, mommy got put her baby pajamas on. Why baby get your pajamas? Do you want to read your book? Oh, 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 the baby. Where is my baby? Where is my baby? Story. Okay. Allah made every animal beautiful little bird and the strong, magnificent lion. Allah wants us to follow his rules. He sent books to tell us what to do and prophets to show us how to act. He wants us to be good to one another. He wants us to care for our parents, our family, our friends, our neighbors, the orphans, and the needy. He wants us to be thankful for everything we have, bismillah, and to look after our world and everything in it. Allah wants us to worship him alone. When we grow up, he wants us to pray five times a day. Allah wants us to fast in the month of Ramadan. Allah wants us to give money to the poor if we can. He wants us to go for Hajj and visit his house in Mecca. All done. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, you want to read it again. Okay. Okay, we'll read it again. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Okay, 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 okay. Lay down. Lay down. My first book about the Quran. You ready to pray? Poor guy, I'm really doing swing shifts like at home. So he has to stay up all night to do whatever he does. I couldn't even I couldn't explain it to you even if I tried. I don't know what he does. All I see is numbers. But apparently they mean something. Y'all, our neighbor is going crazy. Like this self-isolation is getting to him. Poor Amir, like he's just trying to do his work. Like, he's just trying to do his work in peace. Hi! Okay, so last night, I did not fold my clothes. So, I got a pile of clothes I need to fold. So, I don't fold Amir's clothes just because he has a special way of folding it. And... Ain't nobody got time for that. So I'm just folding up mine and then I gotta organize my closet and my hijabs and stuff like that. So I'm gonna try to keep Suli in here. Mmm, those yummy strawberries. It's about like, what, Sully? What time is it? 6.48 p.m. Tuesday. Um, I've come to terms with not being able to fast this Ramadan. Um, I didn't realize how much it was affecting like me and like my milk supply 
until I stopped fasting for a couple of days. Actually, no, three days. After three days have gone um, with me not fasting, my milk supply started coming in like crazy. Like I was just, you know, just so much milk. Like there's leaking milk. And um, while I was fasting, like it wasn't like that. There was not a lot of milk coming out. I've tried to follow some suggestions of trying to drink a lot of water at night and a lot of water during the day. But it's just not something that I can do. Like it is not possible for me to do that because I'm drinking too much water. It's just it just makes me feel sick. So drinking it from sunrise, from sunset to sunrise, is just the amount of water that I need to take. It just for me, I can't take it within that time period. So, um, inshallah, I hope to be able to fast next Ramadan. Hi. 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 Oh, that's your mommy baby. That's your mommy baby. Have fun. Are you ready to go to sleep? Are you ready to go to sleep? When Zuli finally is down for a nap, babe, I'm going to try to go to the halal store to get some meat. Inshallah. Hi, Snookums! Hi. You just playing? What is this? Where's my baby? Where's my baby? You're supposed to go in the tunnel. Go in the tunnel. So alhamdulillah, I was able to, um, I was able to go to the halal store while Sully was sleeping and I was able to get the meat that I needed and some seasonings. Um, so I'm gonna try to make some food tonight. My tire pressure is low. I gotta get some more. Um, I gotta get some air in my tire from, from it sitting there. The tire pressure is all off. So, go do that tomorrow maybe. What is Daddy doing to you? One bit's bigger than the other, Sui. That's everybody. More. Hi. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Peekaboo. You gonna jump rope? Going bye bye. <laughs> Don't run. Don't run. He basically ran today. Like, I mean, he was he was going in there, baby. He was like running. Oh, man, you're not running until both feet are up. Hey, Snookums. You don't have anything in your mouth, do you? I'm sorry. I just wanted to make sure. I just wanted to make sure. I'm about to go to the park. It's like noon o'clock. Noon o'clock. Wow. It's noon. I'm going to go to the park with Suli, take his 11-month portraits, and then... Look at the outfit. You got a bow tie? You got a bow tie? Let's go to the park. Okay, so for tonight's iftar, we have some nan samosas, some beef, slow cook stuff, uh, chocolate milk, strawberry milk, yogurt for the food. 
about to be four o'clock and I've been up since about 12. Um, basically one o'clock because around 10 o'clock I took, I fell asleep and I fell asleep before praying. Ooh, boy, careful, be careful. So I fell asleep before I prayed Isha. So I was putting Suli to bed around like 10 o'clock and um, like as I was feeding him, like we ended up falling asleep and I woke up to the sound of Amir because he had to go into work so he's working a late night shift. So I woke up to the sound of him and I was like, oh gosh, what time is it? So it was like one o'clock basically. So I was like, oh man. Um, so I prayed Isha and I couldn't go back to sleep after that. So I was like, you know what, let me clean up. So I've been like cleaning up um, and then Suli woke up so I brought him out with me. So now I'm about to get Amir Sahor ready. What are you doing? That's mommy's iPad pen. Oh, oh boy. Oh my goodness. Give me this. You dangerous baby. You're a dangerous baby. You cannot have this. You almost stabbed your eye out. How many of you didn't? Oh my goodness. People would be like, well, you should have been watching your baby instead of making videos. Well, nothing we can do about that now. I didn't even get cutting my oranges. I thought it was, uh, I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. Oh man, it was such a beautiful experience. Don't touch. Orange. What are you making, babe? Chicken fried rice in the dirty kitchen. <laughs> wow, you really gonna call me out like that? No one asked you to cook in a dirty kitchen? And by dirty, there's what, like 10 dishes in there? That looks delicious, babe. <laughs> 